Guys, I'm doing an unedited vlog today because I'm simply too lazy to edit anything. So I'm just gonna do an un unedited vlog. I am going to the gym for the first time, me and Brooke, Ooh. to like an actual gym instead of like Pilates. She's gonna like it, I know it. Yeah. And I'm really excited to listen to my own music, that's all. Mm -hmm. that's that all. honestly is like the bonus of the whole entire experience. Yeah. Because um, at Pilates we have to obviously listen to whatever they're playing. We can't put headphones in because that's like one disrespectful and two, you need to listen to what they're saying. Yeah. So this is going to be great. Yeah, I'm really excited. Um, so yeah, we're doing an unedited vlog and I need to edit today a video that has to be sent in oh, that I forgot about. So... <laughs> <laughs> but it's fine because I can just send it in later, so it's fine. Okay. Um, and I forgot that I was filming, so I'm filming on my phone right now. But yeah, you wouldn't want to bring your camera. Right now. I'm also just like a mess today. Like, why am I forgetting everything? Okay, we'll see you guys when we're in the gym. Bye, guys. I'm being such a good girl right now. I really am. My legs are already killing me. Bad. Two more circuits to go. I don't know what I'm doing. She's just like, let's do it. I'm doing it. And also, I'm sweating. I don't like sweating. Unless I'm like at Pilates. Like standing there talking about cleaning. He's done. This yeah. is this is what happens at the gym. I've heard from plenty of people. But you just have to wait for the machines. Yeah. And then you just, it's just crazy. Should I record on my workout? Oh my god, you guys would love it. Is it showing already? I think it is. I think it's showing. We're literally doing legs. I'm like, guys, is it showing? Yeah. I'm back from the gym. Um, that was a crazy workout. I've definitely had crazier ones because it's my first day, so I didn't want to go too crazy. Pee pee. Um, <clears throat> I. <clears throat> what is going on? Ew, Penelope's mouth just looks like disgusting right now. Like I'm not having it. Um, my skin is so dry. I just have to drench my whole body in oil. That's why I'm in a robe because if I put clothes on, it's gonna like stain it. So. That's why I'm in a robe. I'm not doing well right now. Um, guys, I have like no creativity in me today, but I need to edit, so God, give me the strength. I haven't had creativity in me in a while, but maybe if I, when I get back into the groove of things, I'll feel a little bit better. Hopefully, we're gonna, we're gonna hope for that because I don't know anymore. I don't know. Um, I want to make a smoothie. I just had eggs because that was my first meal of the day. I wanted to work out while I didn't eat yet. And I just had eggs and then I'm going to make a smoothie with like strawberries, bananas, mango, pineapple, blueberries. <clears throat> and that's, that's what we're doing. This feels so good right now. I haven't ice rolled in like a week and it just feels too good. Guys, I have to start getting ready for my birthday. And like, I don't want it to come. Like, I really don't. Like, I'm being so real. Like, I don't know. I just really don't want to be 18. I'm scared of it. I'm really scared of it. Um, I need to like get my skin prepped for it. I need to self tan. I need to shave my legs, shave my whole body. <sighs> Guys, so my dress is like long ish and it's supposed to end like at your shins, but of course, that's like a literal gown on me. Like it has like a train and everything because I'm that short. <laughs> and I had to get 11 inches taken off of it because I'm so short. Isn't that so embarrassing? Like, I need to get it together. Like, ugh, whatever. But you know what? It's okay because I'm fun-sized. So, yeah. Guys, I just remembered. I um, it, A subscriber came up to me at a concert. She's like, oh my god, you're short like me. I'm like, babe, we're fun-sized. Like, we're fun-sized. Like, oh my god, shut up. Like, no one wants to hear you talk anymore, babe. <sighs> yeah. <clears throat> also, someone came up to me crying. I literally think about it every day, I swear to God, it was the sweetest thing ever, but like, I just don't understand why people cry for me, because I like, don't do anything, like, I'm not anything special, but, I don't know, I'm just that, like, really, really emotional, um, that was so sweet, and I love you, and whenever you guys come up to me, it makes me so happy, I love you guys so much, um, <clears throat> on editing videos are so weird because I feel like I can't just like relax I have to just like keep talking and talking like sometimes while I'm filming I'll just go on my phone for like 10 minutes and just like leave the camera on and then like when I'm ready to talk I'll start talking but I need I can't do that I can't leave dead air for you guys that's so that's so boring and like lonely so yeah my room is so clean 
and I'm excited. So for my birthday, I'm gonna do it on Saturday. My birthday's on Tuesday, so I'm gonna do it on Saturday instead. And all my friends, um, we're gonna we're all gonna go to dinner together and just have the best time. It's gonna be a big party. Not really a party. I just want it to be like a chill dinner with all my best friends. So it's gonna be really fun. <clears throat> and blended my back, just did my makeup, and I'm really excited. Um, my dress is cute. We're staying in a hotel. We're gonna have the best time, and I'm really excited. And you guys are obviously gonna come along for everything. Ugh. Okay, I don't feel like talking anymore. Bye. This smoothie is so good. I can't even believe it. I eat smoothies with a spoon because it's just more fun. But this is like the best smoothie I've ever made, I think. Over. I think there's banana, strawberry, blueberries, pineapple, mango, and I think that's it. I'm not really sure because I have just like a mixed thing like frozen in the freezer and, and I just like pour it in there so I don't really know what's in it but this is amazing I need to wait for the oil I don't know if I said this but I had to just put body oil on I really don't remember so I'm sorry it's the second I'm saying it and I can't cut it out because it's not edited um I had to put body oil on because my skin's so dry and then if I put on clothes it will stain them so yeah I'm waiting for the oil to like settle in Woo. top notch okay so i just got myself together i'm wearing this white fox like half zip sweatshirt this is like my favorite thing ever they're so comfortable i wear these all the time i think i have a code uh i think it's just my name so if you guys want to shop these like don't be shy and i'm wearing these pants from peace love world they're the most comfortable things ever put on my body i wear both of these things literally every single day and it's just it's just so good and i washed my hair last night guys and it's literally greasy, so I don't know what that's about. But I'm getting my hair done soon. Like, I'm going to go blonder and all that fun stuff. So you guys are obviously going to come along. That's going to be in my, like, get ready with me for my birthday vlog. Um, so, yeah. I think me and Brooke are going to go to Trader Joe's. And that's my update for now. That's my update. My crew joined us. I'm doing an unedited vlog, so What's don't say up, anything girlies? silly. Tell them, tell them, what did we do? Deal today. Paul did a brand <laughs> deal. Can you tell them about it? Was it my first brand deal today, guys? <laughs> well, it wasn't paid, but it was. I'm scrolling on my Instagram stories and I see him being like, guys, you need to come here. It's so good. And I'm like, what's going on? And he did a brand deal. He's doing a full body scan. Yeah, <laughs> it, was yeah really it was cool. Easy. It was this company for body percent fat and stuff and they said hey if you want to come in we'll just post on your story <laughs> that's we'll, so good we'll cop your whole trip and i said i'm there sign me up and it was really cool so, <laughs> so you know collapsed. follow me on instagram at paul Miano, <laughs> dr with my dan collabs, keep up with my dr dan. dr dan any future inquiries yes keep, yeah any DM future him. inquiries companies at paul Miano, at paul Miano 23 <laughs> at hotmail.com uh whatever you want wow dude you should not put your email in a YouTube video. I, it can't be cut out. So oh, wow. It's, it's going in. It's done. Hit me up on email. Uh, oh, only, only email. email. back. Only via email. You'll email back? I email back. Next time we want to hang out, we have to email. Yeah. Via email. You have to RSVP. <laughs> Just hit me in the... In the RSVP to our hangout. Email. RSVP to gang night. Should I do that next time? <laughs> oh. Make, a, make an <laughs> RSVP. Yeah. Next time we hang email out, chain. You're going to have to have to ask everybody to please RSVP by 8 p.m. I'll see, see you guys in. <laughs> <laughs> okay, we're on the way to Traders. Am I gonna go on the highway or yes, what? Girl. Okay, bye. bye. Guys, I like don't really know what I'm getting, but we're gonna we're gonna see. I am so sore already. I literally can't move my legs. Also, these shoes, I like can't walk in them. Guys, I'm doing nothing in Trader right now. I'm just like being here just for moral support, and Brooke's doing everything. And. This is the damage so far. Where do you think that would be? Mommy just got really hungry. Really, really hungry. So I don't know what to do about that. What should I do? Should I just like eat the floor or something? Like I don't understand. Whatever. Guys, I'm too hungry for this occasion right now. I really am. What, the one in there? Yeah. It's so good. Well, this is all making me nauseous, I think. Yeah. Wait, can you like, stand Like, anything here? dairy makes me sick. I mean, not anything, but like, 
cheese. Like, I, I don't know if I've said this online before, but I do not eat cheese. Not because I, not because I choose to. I just absolutely hate it. Like, the only type of cheese I'll eat is on pizza or like Parmesan, like sprinkled over pasta, and that's it. Any other cheese, I get sick over it. So, fun fact. Just randomly got into the worst mood possible, but I'm home and I'm annoyed and everything is pissing me off and I just want to sleep until I can't anymore. I'm hungry and I'm annoyed, so bye. Watching Gossip Girl and rethinking my whole life. <laughs> Guys, I'm just, this video is so uninteresting. I'm just not having an interesting day, I'm sorry. But I'm trying here, okay? Fun thing to know about me. <laughs> Hold on, I need to pause this. Is that I can't do two things at once. Like, even if I'm speaking, like, I can't pay attention to whatever is going on. Like, I cannot, like, if I'm on my phone, like, I can't hear you. Like, it's just, it's really unfortunate. Maybe I should work on it. I love Gossip Girl. Um, <laughs> I had a salad and strawberries, and now I'm waiting for dinner. I'm just like out of it today. I'm not having the best day, but it's okay. <laughs> Nothing new here. You guys, look at how beautiful my girl is, Lulu. <gasps> Hi, babe. Oh my goodness, you're so gorgeous. <laughs> She's like, Mom, what's not with the camera? Literally, all I do is take pictures of her all day. It's so embarrassing. Lulu. Guys, I'm, I don't know. No, don't leave me. No, no, no. We just had dinner. It was like a pesto flatbread. It was good. Not the best, but it, it, it was fine. Um, and now we're going to watch Real House Vibes of New Jersey. Everybody saying oh. fours. So yeah. this is, this Club. vlog, yeah. I can't edit four. anything out, so don't say anything oh, yeah. stupid. I knew they would. So there's. 36 votes for, for uh, floors and four votes for toilets. <laughs> so, I don't even know what happened because I wasn't out so here when this happened. Said, I was in my room. If you wear your shoes in the house, you might as well just lick toilets. <laughs> I said, how? That's two opposite ends of your body. How does that even make sense? She said, well, babies lick floors when they're on the floor. And if you wear your shoes babies, in the house, that's dirty. Babies like touch the floor and then and then put their hands in their mouth. And if you've been walking all over the place, you're stepping in dog shit, cat shit. Um, I don't think people none are None of that goes in the toilet. What? what? Dog crap and cat. But Doesn't even go in the toilet. The same thing. Cats do that on the floor? Actually, there Since are when? cats that go to the bathroom in the real toilet. Yeah. But anyway, so I did a poll. Asking if you're a shoes on household, would you rather lick your floors or your toilets? And my mom can't even answer that she would lick toilets, but she is leaning towards that, but she can't actually say it out loud. She's it's trying true. to say that she would rather lick toilets. Than my floor. point is just this whole conversation is just disgusting. Wearing shoes in the house is disgusting. Like Sorry to anyone who's a, who's a shoes on households because you just flamed them. <laughs> Disgusting. Well, she, she thinks it's like a bacterial issue. Like you're gonna get sick. No, yeah. it actually toughens you up. No, it's, it's just actually. Dirtier. If you if you it, wear your shoes in the house, done about it builds up your meta studies. your um your I'm, immune I'm system. This is what she reads about that. every oh, night. She's pulling up the studies. Oh, now you're getting the stats. I'm not kidding. Like <laughs> if I take one step in the house with the shoe on, it's like I just killed I, the family dog. I, every Let time me I step something. on the steps of my shoes, it's like. <laughs> Listen, when I grew up, we were a shoe on household. I even wore my shoes to bed. But that's <laughs> Are you being serious? Point. No. no. I oh never, my god, I got so I was worried. never sick a day in my life that until I lived here and started taking my shoes off, and That's now I'm always sick. <laughs> She's pulling up the receipts from yes, websites. There's an old African yeah. proverb that states when you leave your shoes at the doorstep, you leave your troubles behind. Okay, then I won't read all the rest. Then if you talk, uh, wait. A group of environmental chemists who study what kinds of contaminants people are exposed to in their own homes weighed in on the great shoe debate, and it turns out we were right. Wearing your outside shoes inside won't just mess up your carpet, it is in fact scientifically 
Gross. Oh, <laughs> shoes they use worn, the word gross. Shoes worn outside can be vectors for all kinds of dirt and microbes. We already know this, but just how dangerous is it? According to the experts, it's danger. <laughs> according to the experts, about one third of the matter building up inside your home comes from outside. Much of it being tracked in on the soles of your shoe of our shoes. Think about licking a toilet or a floor. And on, <laughs> nobody's <laughs> gonna. Nobody's gonna pick to look this Also, way. guys, this looks so. <laughs> talking about dirt, this looks disgusting. What? But it's the couch covers that were just I'm, being washed, I'm okay? I'm washing the couch covers, you see? That's what started <laughs> the whole disgusting topic. Was the that couch The, the couches couch look disgusting. Drama. I said. Okay. I mean, Drama. they don't look good, no, but. That's exactly what I said. Why did we get these colored couches in the first place? I, I don't it know, do, we were it there. doesn't look good. I don't, good. Know, I don't know. Okay. And they're uncomfortable, too. They're okay, good. I'm talking. Um, wow! Um, if I did that, I would get pike. killed. I would get shunned. And on uh, and on the shoes, they have found a high prevalence of microbiological pathogens. <laughs> what the well, hell is that? Here and say not all dirt is bad dirt. Some household germs can actually be useful in helping build up a right. child's immune system. Mm -hmm. For example. But the real issue is that <laughs> some of the disease-causing organisms found on our shoes and floors <laughs> are drug-resistant, causing illnesses that are difficult to treat. Add in cancer-causing toxins from wow. asphalt road residue, scientists say, and endocrine-disrupting lawn chemicals, and you might view the filth on your shoes in a new light. I'm never going outside In plain again. speak, it is we best if you leave... Wait, wait. I'm in listening. In plain speak, it is best to leave your filth outside the no, door. No, your filth. <laughs> um, uh, we should we shouldn't even wear clothes inside no. because this is okay. crazy. I mean, think about how much visible dirt we carry with us on the soles of our shoes: mud, dog poop, sand, and gravel, <laughs> debris from outdoor parks, and all other filthy places that our shoes end up in in the course. What of about the? For what many, about dogs? Like, because the they touch shark. the same For thing. For many households, the pandemic has yeah, been what dogs you know feet pause? touch the Should same. Her yeah, she's in the backyard and in the house. Why is the backyard not dirty? We wear our shoes back there. That's right. You know what though? I do feel dirty. like the backyard is like another, it's like sanitized somehow. No, it's not sanitized. Like, when I'm in the backyard, I, I have no problem. Like, it just feels, I don't know, uncomfortable. Well, you know? wouldn't, well, yeah, you feel comfortable, but you wouldn't put your feet in uh, on your sheets, would you? I would lick my foot. No, if you no, no. Yeah, no. Um, you would okay. like your this foot in the toilet on the floor. Dirty man no. over here. You would dip your toe in the toilet, step on the floor, yep. and then yep. lick it. Yes, I would. <laughs> yeah. That's exactly it. Just stops reading. Yeah. Mid, no, no, no. Because I, I don't want to read the, the whole thing yet. Wait, I'm going to put on. You ever hear that expression, don't believe everything you read? Someone hasn't over here. And she's wearing blue and green. <laughs> On the couch with no covers. <laughs> I need chapstick. I don't want to get up at all. I need to just get my whole life together. After doing your part, <laughs> she's it's still time going. To your friends she's still going. Join in. Making your guests she's feel more comfortable going. with having their shoes off is a great first step toward ensuring they're as committed to your new house rules as you are. Give them I... more slippers. Indoor slip. She she has to. Buy, she's she's gonna start buying slippers Harry for everyone. That. Really? Yeah. I honestly, when I have my own house, I'm just gonna say take, take your shoes off. It's not really. I wouldn't really feel. Crazy. Like anyone who's in my house, I would feel comfortable enough to be like, yeah, we're not doing shoes in here. I think yeah. Yeah. Right? Like, come on, guys. She found she found a thing saying our toilets. <gasps> Like dirtier shoes. than shoes. Says, are shoes dirtier than toilets? I didn't type that in. I just found it. <laughs> a study conducted by Good Morning America and the University of Arizona found that shoes are dirtier than a toilet seat. Toilets typically contain 1,000 bacteria or less compared to the 66 million found on one of the test subject shoes. First of all, one shoe. <laughs> first of all, I think it's a blank screen and she just made all that up. <laughs> This is the worst unedited vlog I've ever done. I woke up this morning, started it on my phone because I forgot my camera, went to the gym, came home, laid in bed all day, barely filmed, and now we're talking about shoes and toilets. Depending on the t how long does bacteria live 
on the bottom you should choose. Depending on the type of fabric, bacteria can survive from several days to over six months. Bullshit. They live longer on cotton than on than on polyester blends because cotton is more absorbent. This is crazy. <laughs>